the price of Miria continues to tank. Is this a good time to buy? Difficult one. Welcome back to Bear Man Crypto where we talk all things crypto. Miria is a project that I've been following for quite some time. Um, when they first announced that their token was going live and they announced their node sale, I started accumulating tokens and did buy a whole bunch of tokens pretty much near the top. And obviously since then, the price has suffered a fair bit. You can see here, um, originally when the nodes were going on sale, the price hit a peak of um, 0.78. And since then, obviously, you can see the chart for yourself. The price has been in a downward spiral. You can see over the last 30 days, it's down 47%. So I found myself thinking, is this a good time to continue buying Miria? And personally, I am bullish long term. Once we do hit the bull run, that this project will provide amazing returns. Um, however, at this stage in time, it is difficult to see how the price can can really recover. And the price has, has suffered for a number of reasons, I think. Um, basically, obviously, the nodes went on sale and um, the distribution has started. And really, I think the price pressure from this has been coming from potentially people selling their distribution. You can see here the node is currently available on sale for um, $4,500, which equates to just over 2 million uh, Miria tokens at the current price. Um, and holding the node gets you um, daily distribution rewards um, once you have your node online as well as um, access to various NFTs um, as a node holder. Um, so I think the current daily distribution of, of tokens equates to, I think, I think it, it might have been about two and a half thousand Miria, roughly something along those lines. Um, and the people that do own these uh, nodes, um, like anyone else, what I imagine that they're probably doing is they're trying to recover their original costs. And hence why you've got such big selling pressure um, on the Miria token price. And one of the potential issues as well is with the token out live at the moment, there is not necessarily much utility available. So people are literally, as they're getting them, selling them. Um, but obviously Miria as a project itself, you know, they've got loads of games in development. And once these do come on board, you know, it's, it will be massive for the ecosystem. But I think the pace at which the games are coming online um, is really limiting the amount of utility available or to incentivize people really to hold the node. If they were to introduce potentially staking, that's one of the areas that I think would potentially help with uh, sustaining the price. Um, but at the moment, there's no staking available. There was an announcement that staking would become available at some stage, but no further news on that. In terms of games that will be coming on board, um, shortly we'll have this cricket game by AB De Villiers. Um, you've got Moonville Farms and Metacrush, which will be doing their games shortly. There was one which had a sale um, about a week ago, um, a poker game. Um, so they did their own sale um, for their specific token. And I think potentially node owners for uh, Miria will potentially get um, a piece of that pie. I'm not quite sure what that would look like. And also you've got people that are migrating to Miria. You've got um, Dragonry. Um, that announced recently that they'll be building on uh, basically essentially migrating to Miria. So that's obviously positive news. Uh, but at the moment, the price itself, it's, it's, yeah, it hasn't really helped with the price. And if we have a look at it here um, on trading view, it's a bit more, um, you can see it plain and clear in terms of how much this price has been suffering. So where I bought was round about this mark here around this point naught naught eight uh price and obviously I did panic and I sold some of mine around this point naught naught four 
Um, and then since then, I, what I have been doing, and I think personally what I'll continue to do is slowly accumulate um, the tokens as they continue to drop. And you can see here um, the tokens, the, the token price has continued to drop. Um, even looking here on the daily time frame, we've been in this oversold territory for a period of time and could potentially remain in this oversold um, area for a period of time. So what I'm personally doing is I am accumulating a fixed, uh, I've got a fixed amount that I want to purchase in terms of Myriad tokens and I'm um, buying those over a long period of time. So if this continues, if the price continues to fall, then great. I can just acquire more Myriad tokens, but what I'm not doing is buying it all in one go. My strategy is I'm hoping that I can accumulate enough that at some stage when the price does start to recover, it won't cost me as much to buy a node um, based on the current price today. Um, I would hope that at some point when the price does recover, we'll get maybe, I don't know, two, three, uh, hundred percent pump, which, you know, based on what I'm buying now should be sufficient then to get me more than enough to get a node as well as have additional tokens to uh, left over um, to hold long term. Um, but I think for the important thing really for Miria to, you know, to start to bottom out this price and stabilize it a bit is to uh, make sure that some of their games come online as quickly as possible and potentially introduce staking. Um, that will just help to alleviate the selling pressure on the token. But this is definitely one to watch. Um, if Gala was able to do it in the last bull run, so can Miria. Um, you can see here the total supply is 50 billion, so it's um, similar to Gala. Um, uh, so, you know, it's got a lot of games in its uh, in the pipeline, again, going for it. Um, so this is definitely one to watch. Definitely not go all in. Uh, obviously not financial advice. Make sure you do your own further research. But Miria, yeah, definitely one to watch. Um, if you enjoyed that content, make sure you like this video. And I'll see you in the next video.